Warning, the following video contains flashing lights, foul language, suggestive themes, and gratuitous violence against the undead. Viewer discretion is advised. Ah, welcome oh, well, morning, to my stretch. bedroom. Don't think that me letting you in here is an invitation for any funny stuff. I mean, not that I have a problem with funny stuff. I know. Especially not if you really like the person. But that isn't what I wanted to talk about. Today is, as they say in Spain, my cumpleaños. That's right, my birthday. I'm 18 today. Ooh, not a native speaker. These are my girls on the San Romero cheer squad. We've gone to the Nationals three years in a row. But we haven't won yet. Oh, three times uh, in To keep my energy up, I eat lollipops. I know what you're thinking. I'm getting so fat. I ain't gonna get the beat they're so yum. This is my family. My older sister Cordelia won a gold medal in riflery last year. And she has a lot of secret meetings with guys I think are college scouts. My little sister Rosalyn just got her license, which makes me kind of think the DMV are idiots. My girlfriends that, say my dad is a total is dope, rifle. But try as they might, they could never come between him and my mom. She is so cool. It's because of her, my sisters and I all wear our vaginas proudly. God, she and my dad love each other so much. Oh, that's nice. Speaking of true love, this is my boyfriend, Nick. It F's me up how much I really like him. My family's throwing me a birthday party after oh, school. Hey Nick is totally freaked out having to meet my family for the first time. But I'm even more freaked out for him to find out about my family. Because even though they're the most amazing ever, some of our traditions are a little... unusual. Ah, Nick. Looks like a good all-around kid. Nick's already so sweet to never complain about my ginormous fat butt. If he finds out I'm the number one world's biggest weirdo, he might not stick around. Well, that's quite the claim to be so the world's sad, number one biggest cry weirdo. Forever. Oh no! I'm totally late! I was supposed to meet him before school! I'm so lame! Ugh. I hope Nick isn't mad. That's about the worst thing that could ever happen! Irritating. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Muscle Gerbil plays Lollipop Chainsaw. Oh, another beautiful day at high school. Jocks, nerds, goths, punks, emo kids. Those kids you never really even notice. But today we've got a new class of student. Zombies. Of course, this is Lollipop Chainsaw. This is from Grass Hap Grass Hopper Manufacture. Uh, directed by Goichi Suda, better known as Suda51, and written, at least in part, by James Gunn, better known as the director of the Guardians of the Galaxy movies. The wildly popular Marvel films. 
So we're Juliet Starling. It's our birthday today. We were late for school. We're a little anxious because as we saw in the opening scene, the boyfriend is going to meet the family today. Oh, that's always the worst. That's always the worst feeling. If you've ever gone through that, you know then your nerves on both sides are... It's tense. It's a tense feeling. Alright. Looks like we're gonna have ourselves a little fun with these zombies because we're already late for school. So we gotta get to class. Don't want the truant officer to come after us. Oh yeah. Oh, those kids are dead. That's not good. Jeez, it sucks when things explode. I need to find Ooh! -hoo. Sparkle hunting. Okay, I like that. Go for it. Oh, I thought I was gonna get another one. So this game is a character action hack and slash. Kind of in the veins of your God of War, Ninja Gaiden, Devil May Cry. Can I think of any other examples? I'm sure there's uh, Bayonetta. Your game's like that. It's so far pretty basic control scheme, it looks like. Uh, square is melee attack with the pom poms. And then triangle hits you with the chainsaw. The titular lollipop chainsaw. Oh no. Okay. Looks like a. Well, we got a rescue helicopter. That's nice during a zombie outbreak. But. If zombie movies have taught me anything, that helicopter might be in for a rough day. Is Frank West in there? Is he taking pictures? Oh, this person needs help. I'm coming. Be safe or be sorry. Hold it right there, you zombie jerks. I'll help you. So I don't seem to be doing much damage at all to these zombies at the moment. Like most character action games. I'm gonna have to upgrade my stuff. There's no... I guess there's a dedicated jump button. Oh! Right in half. So there's no dedicated jump button, but circle will do an evasion, which I guess doubles as a jump. But it doesn't look like I can jump onto the environment. Probably to prevent sequence breaking. Ooh, that's a nice move. Okay, and then... Triangle's regular attack. And X is a low attack. Ooh, zombie medals. Okay, so... Kill things, get currency, upgrade. Driving. Wait, Juliet in the Matrix? I didn't know cheerleading taught you how to backflip away from moving vehicles. That is one big lollipop. Yeah. Lollipops restore your health. Access with D-pad and use them. I've already played through the first little part of the game. Um, before for some test footage so that's why I'm not getting any tutorial prompts popping up I'm sure they'll pop in pretty soon though because I did not get too far into this game your license should be revoked, bro. I'll rip out your uh, these zombies are already missing their legs So 
we've got our basic attacks. I'm trying to learn how to animation cancel. I don't think you can animation cancel the first hit of this. But you can cancel a second, third, and fourth. Chainsaw, you can just immediately triangle circle, and you can dodge away. So I feel like that's going to be super useful in this game, is learning how to animation cancel to get better combos and better, better streaks. These zombies are everywhere. Right? I am I am super late to school if all these people are here already, got infected, and are planning ambushes. Like what what is it? Like fourth period already? Fifth period? Just fake sick. All in sick that day. Get ready for the boyfriend to come over to the house. Oh, come on, I want a sparkle hunt. Uh, I guess they weren't close enough. Ooh! <laughs> that guy just hit me with a big combo. It does look like the zombies take... You know, limb damage. And that dodging can actually start knocking them over. Huh. Ha <laughs> Woohoo! This girl is nimble. Right in half. Oh, you get a cool little rainbow effect when you do that. I like that. Oh, I'm getting swarmed. Oh, I'm getting swarmed. Right. Getting swarmed. Right away. There we go. Alright, rescued two out of three. Back in the bus. So the these zombies are driving school buses? Come on, get away from me. Interesting. Zombies can start driving. I don't know why, but I really like that leapfrog animation. Like, that's just funny. Just gonna hop over you. I feel like I'm relying on my light techniques a little too much. Gonna start getting some real chainsaw action going here. Oh! Get off me! Oh, come on, I wanna cut him in half. So, circle right over. There we go. Ooh. Got he. My favorite president is Warren G. Harding. It's an interesting president to have as a favorite. Am I gonna get fun facts for other people that I save? Oh no, oh no, no, no. Don't get hurt, buddy. I don't know why you wouldn't stick close to the person with the chainsaw, but... He has more flight than fight response. Right. Doesn't look like I can actually damage him with my chainsaw. That's nice. Excuse me. I need to heal. Oh, you get a lot of health from lollipops. Okay. I have the, f the feeling I missed something back in another area. Probably missed out on some sort of collectible. Oh, that's for another time. Saw through the gate. Kick it open. Okay, there's some people uninfected. Oh, that's a lot. That's quite the swarm. 
Check this out. I have literally no techniques. I'm just gonna mash this one out. The tutorial says to use R2, which puts you in like a super mode. Um, like your God of War rage mode. Or, uh, they call it something different every game. So I can't remember all of them. Or like your devil trigger. R2 is like your devil trigger when the gauge in the bottom left is full. But I don't want to use that right now. I want to see if I can just take them all out myself. Oh, and I get some sparkle hunt. Pop it! Pop it! Ah, ah, beat me up. Oh, there's 25 of them. Okay, they are not messing around when it comes to the number of enemies they throw at you. Okay, go low and get this guy on the ground. Alright, three more. Two more. Show him that spirit, Juliet! Decap. Decap. Whew. That was intense. Oh, there's more. Of course there's more. Mm. Quick time events. Good old PS3 era. Quick time event. Oh, that dropkick is powerful. That thing sends a flying. I gotta remember not to abuse it, though. It's got a long recovery animation. Ooh. That seems really OP. To just leapfrog him and cut him in half. That'll probably get me into trouble if I'm swarmed, though. Fantastic job, kid. No problem, helicopter pilot. Where's the bee? Hold on, it's too dangerous. I'll meet you in the square. Oh no. Oh, yep. Called it. Tell my wife I said he crashed all over the hello. Is probably dead. Oh, there's that Suda 51 style. Hey, it's mom, Juliet. What? Hope you're taking care of yourself. Don't do anything stupid. Okay. Do I have an old school style rotary phone? Like, built into the chainsaw? That's, that's pretty cool. So I guess Juliet likes that retro style. Wow, now is the perfect time to do some shopping. Awesome. Alright, we're at the shop. The ch All right, so we're here in the shop. Uh, for the first few episodes, there's not going to be any music or sound effects uh, on the shop. There's a song I don't think I can use during my Let's Plays. Uh, that should be remedied probably around the fourth episode. But this is your your typical character action game shop. You have health and upgrades... To increase your strength, increase your health, increase your recovery. And then you can buy new moves, new combos. You can also buy new music tracks, new outfits, and concept art from the shop here. Your moves and abilities will cost gold coins. And then everything else will cost platinum coins. It's a really good song, though, in the shop menu item, shop screen. It's uh, Lollipop by the Cordettes, which is a, a nice retro song. But I don't feel comfortable using it during the playthrough. 
So you're just gonna have to withstand my my lovely voice right into your ears. But that should be fixed in a few episodes when I figure out um, my recording setup properly. So we went through, we bought we bought a couple of things. So we're a little bit more powerful now as we move on to the next area. I'll see you at the other side of the menu. Alright. Kick it open. Ugh. Come on, kick it. Well, I can't control the camera in this point. So, got some fixed perspective. Get out of my way. I'm in a hurry. Let's try out this triangle thing. Three, four, five, six. No. Oh, get off me. Oh no. Ugh. That's a good crowd control move. Ow! Alright, let me test out that move I was talking about before. So it's kind of like the stinger where you just shove the chainsaw forward. Are those two zombies making out? Do these zombies have feelings? Or like emotions? That would not be good. Ooh, more metals. And a lollipop, okay. Yeah, so you can't jump onto the environment unless you get a prompt. But depending on how well programmed the game is. There's probably glitches and collision detection issues in some spots. We'll just have to find them. I'm not gonna be trying to like Metroid sequence break this or anything. Or am I? No, I'm not. Hey, score 50,000 even. I like it. This probably isn't gonna be good. Oh! That's a lot of zombies. There's a lot of, like, greasers in this school. I wonder what year this is even supposed to take place in. Oh, Gotta okay, kill 26 of them. So there's more coming. That's very rude to say. That lasts a fair amount of time for being, like, not even upgraded. Oh. These crawling zombies always give me trouble for some reason. Oh. Heck yeah. Alright, we cleared them out. Oh, I should probably heal. And eh, we'll heal up when we get closer to death. Pete Townsend slide. Ow. No one locks on. Right stick changes. Uh, how do I answer my phone?
I don't know how to answer my phone. Square? No, it's not square. It's square. Okay, there's the lock-on. I'm not a big fan of lock-ons in character action games. Just because I like to have that freedom of movement. Unless it's a single... Unless it's a single target. Ooh! George, number one. Oh, that was the kid I saved. He liked Warren G. Harding. Yeah, zombies with health bars might be harder to kill. Who would have thunk? Oh, they're fast. Okay. Oh, okay, excuse me. I was trying to hurt your friend, I think. Oh, I probably should have saved my, um... Devil Trigger. I'm going to keep calling it Devil Trigger. I know I am. I need to heal. Wow. Man, these things do a lot of damage. And they can interrupt. Oh, they can interrupt my combos. Alright, we're just going to go with the old standby, the God of War Puma Prometheus style. Square, square, triangle. Oh, these things are beating me up bad. Alright, got one of them. I don't, don't even know what that said. Too intense. Too intense right now. Huh. Oh, my health bar is flashing. Not good. Got him. All right, here we go, you. Oh, shit. I'm gonna heal again. Okay, I cannot animation cancel out of the combo, it looks like. Middle. All right. Looks like we made it to the school. Wonder what's going to be inside there. If there were that many zombies roaming around the streets, they're all going to be confined inside a gated school. We really got to get to class. That's a good boyfriend. Oh no. Shit. Yeah, you always want to bring a weapon to the zombie apocalypse. Are you okay, Juliet? Yes, I are you? I uh I, uh, one bit me. Just a little bit. I, I don't know what that means. What does it mean? Huh? Oh, no. It can't be. I feel it in me. I'm gonna become one, huh? <laughs> I, fuck. I'm screwing up your birthday, aren't I? I'm sorry, Juliet. I, I don't want to fuck up your birthday. My birthday? 
birthday? Don't worry about that. That's the dumbest thing ever. Uh, 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 listen, I know it's stupid. We just started getting serious, but uh, I wanted you to know. I know I've never said it or anything, but I, I, I kind of sort of, you know. Kind of sort of maybe. Oh, I fucking love you. Oh. <laughs> Nick. Oh, yeah, he's a goner. He's a zombie. No. There's something we can try. It's the only chance we have to save you. Julia? What the fuck? <laughs> Oh, that's true love right there. Wow. Yes. Okay, so I got a C. Got a C rating. Not 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 too happy with that. Because I don't know how the ranking system works yet in this game, but I assume it might go up to S rank. And I don't want to be a C student at San Romero High. So we're going to do better on the next episode. Stay tuned.